Could I get the bill, please? Here you go, madam. What the... Hello, it's Sophie from Britsend. Last time we looked at English words and phrases you can use when talking to your waiter about your order or your food. Today we'll be looking at what you can say when you've got questions about your bill or when you're paying for your food. So let's get started. Firstly, you need to ask for the bill. You could say, could I have the bill? Or could I pay please? Even if you use check, which is more American, people will understand you. But just so you know, bill is much more common in the UK. You can also ask if they accept cash or card by saying, I'd like to pay in cash. Could I pay by card? Or do you take American Express or Amex? Sometimes the bill may even contain items that you don't recognize or are very unspecific. I know I've had bills that simply say main one or starter, all scrawled in handwriting that was so messy I honestly couldn't tell if it was written in English. So to make sure you know exactly what you're paying for, and also so you don't get ripped off, you could ask the waiter, could you go over the bill for me please? Or could you explain the bill to me please? If you want to be more specific, ask, could you tell me what this is on the bill please? In the UK, tipping is not a big part of the culture. Most restaurants, not counting fast food places or takeaways, include an optional service charge of 12.5%. If they don't have a service charge included, it's up to you to decide if you want to leave a tip and how much. By UK standards, 10-15% to 15 is a decent amount but it depends on the situation. If you're paying with cash, you can also tell them to keep the change. Keep the change means they can keep whatever money is left when they take away your bill. You can also add a tip when you're paying by card. Before keying in your PIN number, a card machine will often ask, do you want to add gratuity? Gratuity means tip, so you can choose to add gratuity if you think the service is good. When you're actually paying, you may want to split the bill or go Dutch. So you could ask, could we pay separately or could we have separate bills? This just means you want to pay for exactly what you had. You could also ask, could we split the bill? Which means you want to divide the bill equally between each person. So if you're paying separately, you might need to specify what you're paying for. You can say, I'd like to pay for. For example, I'd like to pay for the soup starter, the steak and the gin and tonic. Or, if you're feeling quite generous, you can tell whoever you're with, I'll get this or this is on me. This means that you will pay for everything. For example, don't worry, this is on me. Or, I'll get this because you helped me out today. And then you can tell your waiter, I'd like to pay for everything, or all together, please. And finally, if you have any food left over, you can ask for a doggy bag or a takeaway box. It's called doggy bag because supposedly people used to take home food to give to their dog, and the name has just stuck. 
So you can ask your waiter, could I have this in a takeaway box? Or could you put this in a doggy bag? That's all from me today. I hope those phrases are useful the next time you go to a restaurant. If there are any situational phrases you want to know, let us know in the comments section below. And if you want to improve your English and take it to the next level, sign up for one-to-one -one classes here at Britson, online or face-to-face. -face. We also offer high-quality editing services and translation from Korean to English. So check out our website for more information. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. About your order or food. Sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. <laughs> 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 <laughs>